Hi students, welcome to the channel NCRT Maths Tutor. In this video, we will discuss functions. A is equal to 1, 2, 3. B is equal to 4, 5, 6. Here two sets are taken. First, we will find the Cartesian product where the pairing of A set elements with B set. So, here we get nearly 9 ordered pairs. Now, from this Cartesian product of A cross B, we will define two relation. One is R is equal to 1, 4, 1, 6, 2, 4, 3, 5, 3, 6. And the another relation is that 1, 4, 2, 6, 3, 5. Now, for these two relations, we will draw the arrow diagram. The arrow diagram can be drawn by using the set elements. In the A set, we have 1, 2, 3. So, 1, 2, 3. In the B set, we have 4, 5, 6. So, this can be taken as 4, 5, 6. Now, we have to write the ordered pairs. 1, 4. The first ordered pair is here. 1, 4. So, 1 is pointing to 4. So, 1, 4. 1, 6. 1 is pointing to 6. 2, 4. 2 is mapping to 4. 3, 5. 3 is mapping to 5. 3, 6. And 3 is mapping to 6. In the same way, the second relation if I consider here also we have 3 ordered pairs. 1, 4. 2, 6. 3, 5. 1 is mapping to 4. 2 is mapping to 6. And 3 is mapping to 5. Now this is a mapping diagram or arrow diagram. Among these two relations here one is a function and another one is not a function. This is a function and this one is not a function. The function means it is a special type of relation. So every function is a relation but we can't call that every relation is a function. It may be a function or it may not be a function. So in this case we have two relations. So this is a function whereas this one is not a function. The reason is that in the case of function there is a condition. The condition is related to images and pre-images. So now among these two arrow diagrams this part is known as all these elements are known as images and all these elements are pre-images. Here these are known as images and these are known as pre-images. Now let us see that. See here the element we have 1. The image of 1 is 4. The image of 2 is 6. The image of 3 is 5. In the same way in this relation the image of 1 is 1 here has two images 4 as well as 6 2 here has one image which is 4 then 3 element the element 3 has here two images 5 and 6 in the same way if i take consider the pre image then in this diagram 4 the element 4 is mapping to 1 as well as it is it's mapped from 1 as well as here 2. So we can say that the pre-image of 4 is 1 and 2. The pre-image of 5 is 3. The pre-image of 6 is 1 and 3. In the same way here also, the pre-image of 4 is 1. The pre-image of 5 is 3. And the pre-image of 6 is 2. So that's about image and pre-image. Now the function concept is related to image and pre-image means in the case of function or to form a function every element of the set the first set has one and only one image in the second set. See here if you observe we have three elements all the elements all the elements have image. So 1, the image of 1 is 4, the image of 2 is 6, the image of 3 is 5. So all the elements have image in the B set. And it, it may be, it is a unique image. The image of 1 is 4, the image of 2 is 6 and the image of 3 is 5. So that's why it is a function. Whereas if you consider the, this condition, this relation, then it is not a function. The reason is that here all the elements have image but the images are not unique. If I consider the element 1, the image of 1 is 4 as well as 6. The element 1 has two images. So that's why we can say that the image is not unique here. And even if you consider the element 3, the element 3 has two images, 5 as well as 6. So that's why this is not a function, whereas this one is a function. Or if you consider the order pairs here directly, see, uh, 
1, 4 here we have. This is x and this one y if I consider. Then 1 is mapping to 4 and the same one is again mapping to 6 here. The 1, the x and if I consider this one as x and this one as y element. See the 1 is mapping to 4 and 1 is mapping to 6. That means this one has 2 images. So this is not considered in the case of function. Even if I take here 3 and 5, 3 is mapping to 5 and 3 again the ordered pair of 3 is with 6 is given. So this is actually not valid in the case of function. In the case of function, one element can have only one image that image is a unique image. So that's why it is not a function whereas this one is a function and the function can be represented by using a symbol f and even the function is nothing but it is a collection of ordered pair. It is a relation, right? And relation is a collection of ordered pairs. So we can represent the function x, y. For example, if you have a function for x, y, then the function can be written as f of x is equal to y. Or here x means the first value and y means the second value. So for example, here you have 1, 4. That means this 1, 4 you can represent in this way f of 1 is equal to 4. This is x and this is y. In the same way, 2, 6, f of 2 is equal to 6. 3, 5, f of 3 is equal to 5. Or in the form of function, symbolic way also, you can represent like this way. The function name f is given. f is a function mapped from set A to B. The set name you have to specify by writing an arrow mark. So that's about a function. Now, the function even you can represent in the form of graph like this way also. Here we will consider some uh, cases of the function and we will understand that uh, whether those examples comes under function or not. So the first case is here. See two sets are given A and B. A consists of four elements 1, 2, 3, 4 and in the B set we have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now we have to check whether this is a function or not. See in the in this case First, let us define a function. As you know, the function can be defined by using a small f. f is a function which is defined from a to b because here the set name is given a and b. Now, you can observe that the to form a function, the rule is that every element of the first set must has unique image. So, if I consider here 1, 2, 3, 4, we have here 4 elements and all the elements have images in the B set. So 1, the image of 1 is 5, the image of 2 is 7 and the image of 3 is 8 and the image of 4 is 6. And not only that one, they have unique image. So that's why this is a function. And you can see that in this part, in the second set, we can leave the elements. Whereas in the first set, all the elements must have images. Whereas here, you can leave the element. Now, let us find the domain, codomain and range. The domain means it is related to the first set, left hand side. And the codomain and range are related to the right hand side. So, domain. The domain means all the set of elements in the first set which are participated in the mapping. Now, if you see this diagram, 1, 2, 3, 4, here we have 4 elements and all the 4 elements are mapped here. So, domain is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4. Then, codomain means all the elements of the second set. In the second set, we have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5 elements. So, that is nothing but codomain and the range is all the elements of the second set which are mapped, which are involved in mapping. That is 5, 6, 7, 8. 9 is not included. So, range is equal to 5, 6, 7, 8. Next. Next here, this is a function. Now, now we will consider the second case. The second case, see here, there are two sets, x and y. In the x set, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In the y set, 7, 8, 9. Now, the image of 1 is 7, the image of 2 is 8, and the image of 3 is 9. Here, you can see that every element has unique image, but all these three elements has unique image. But what about this 4 and 5? The elements 4 and 5 does not, they do not have any like image from in the Y set. So that's why we can't call this one as a function. It is not a function. To form a function, every element must has image in the second set. So now here 4 and 5 
these two elements do not have any image in this y set so that's why it is not a function now uh, which one is the domain and which one is the range or codomain here domain as i told you the domain means the set of elements participated in the mapping here we have 1 2 3 4 5 five elements are there and only three elements are participated in the mapping so domain is equal to 1 2 3 in the same way codomain means all the set of elements in the second set that is 7 8 9 range is equal to all the elements which are participated in the mapping from the second set that is 7 8 9 so codomain domain and range is equal to same here 7 8 9 as this is not a function as here we have these two elements which are not having any image in the y set next here we will consider the next case where here two sets are taken p and q in the p set we have 4 5 6 7 8 in the q set we have 6 7 8 9 now see the image of 4 is 6 the image of 5 is 7 the image of 6 is 7 the image of 7 is 6 and the image of 8 is 8 see now we have to check whether this is a function or not this is a function because the first rule is that all the elements all the elements must have images right 4 5 6 7 8 we have five elements and all the five elements are mapped right so the first condition satisfies the second condition is that Every element must have unique image. Every element must have one image in the another set. So now, the image of 4 is 6, the image of 5 is 7, the image of 6 is 7, the image of 7 is 6 and the image of 8 is 8. So you can observe that here, every element has one image in the Q set. So that's why it is a function. And even you can observe that the element 6 or the element 7, if you take, the element 6 has two pre-images, that is 4 as well as 7. The element 7 has two pre-images, 5 and 6. This is valid in the case of function. A image can have two pre-images, but a pre-image must have only one image. So, this is a function. Now, let us find the domain, codomain and range. The domain is all the set of elements which are participated from the first set 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Here all the elements are mapped. So domain is equal to 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Next codomain. Codomain is 6, 7, 8, 9. The elements of the second set 6, 7, 8, 9. Range is equal to all the elements which are participated in the mapping that is from the second set that is 6, 7, 8. Only three elements are mapped here. So range is equal to 6, 7, 8. Next, let us consider the fourth case. In the fourth case, two sets are given A and B. In the A set, we have 3, 4, 5, 6 and in the B set, we have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now, the image of 3 is 5, the image of 4 is 6, the image of 4 is again 9, the image of 5 is 8, the image of 6 is 7. We have to check now whether this is not, a, whether it is a function or not. The first condition is that all the elements must have images see 3 4 5 6 all the elements are mapped here then the second condition is that every element or all the elements they must have unique image or one image so the image of 3 is 5 only one image it has the image of 4 is 6 as well as 9 so the element 4 here has two images 6 and 9 and this is not valid in the case of function so that's why we can call that it is not a function even see you can observe these two cases here we are talking about images and here we are talking about pre-images this is a first set and this is a second set in this case you can have two pre-images the element 6 has two pre-images 4 as well as 7 this is valid Whereas in this case, we are talking about here what pre-images and the pre-image must have only one image. So this is not valid in the case of function and it is not a function. Then domain, all the elements of the first set which are participated in the mapping 3, 4, 5, 6. So domain is equal to 3, 4, 5, 6. Codomain is equal to all the elements of the second set 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and range is also here 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 as here all the elements are participated in the mapping. Next here we will consider another case, the fifth case. The fifth case is same as we discussed uh, in the uh, second as well as in the fourth case. Here see. Uh, we have to check now this is a function or not. See here also 1, 2, 3, 4. In the first set we have 4 elements. In the second set we have 5, 6, 7, 8. 
four elements. Now the image of one is five and six. Image of two is seven. Three and four are left as it is. So we can clearly say that it is not a function because here the first condition is that every element must has image. So here three and four they do not have any image. So that's why it is not a function. And not only that one. If you consider here element one, the element one has two images. 5 and 6 so this is not valid in the case of function in the case of function a pre image must have has only one image whereas here the pre image one has two images so that's why this is not a function now let us see the domain the domain is 1 to here only two elements are participated in the mapping co domain is 5 6 7 8 and the range is 5 6 7 So this is about function. If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel NCERT Maths Tutor to get more videos. Thanks for watching.